Rathdrum woman who split the second largest lottery jackpot in United States history may have to split her winnings again, this time with her estranged husband. KXY4's Jeff Humphrey is live in Post Falls tonight where that lucky ticket was purchased. And All right, how, how come Holly Lottie may be faced with dividing this prize, Jeff? Well, as best as we can tell, the Lotties are still legally married. Even though Mr. Lottie says they are now separated, it's likely he's now entitled to half some $40 million of his estranged wife's winnings. A license here in the Cooney County Recorder's Office shows Josh Lottie and Holly Alford were wed in Coeur d'Alene in May of 2001. However, over time, relatives say the pair stopped living together. Today at the courthouse, we could find no record of any divorce proceedings in Idaho or Washington. And according to an attorney with a law firm, Palmer and George, if a divorce never happened, Mr. Lottie can legally claim half of his estranged wife's winnings. Any property acquired during marriage under Idaho law is presumed to be community property, which means that uh, there's a presumption that he has an equal interest in the, in the lottery winnings that were acquired during marriage. There are a few exceptions to the community property rule, like if Mrs. Lottie could prove she got her winning ticket as part of a gift or inheritance, but legal experts say she now faces an uphill battle keeping all of her money. It would be essentially her burden to establish that it was acquired in some manner that accepts it out of the presumption of being community. Now we don't know if Holly Lolly was already planning to share her winnings with her husband, although Mr. Lolly said he learned of his wife's good fortune in the news media. Reporting in Post Falls, Jeff Humphrey, KXLY4.